triangle A, B, and C is a right triangle, as shown in the figure. Where AB equals 8 cm and AC equals 6 cm. If BC and AC are tangents to the circle and the semicircle, find the area of the circle. Note that, the figure is not drawn to scale. First let's draw a straight line from C to pass through the center of the circle and the center of the semicircle. Next, we draw a perpendicular line from the center of the semicircle to the tangent beat C. Let the center of the semicircle be M, and the point of intersection of the perpendicular line to the tangent be N. Also let's draw a perpendicular line from the center of the circle to the tangent AC, and another perpendicular line from the center of the circle through line AB. Let's call this point D, the center of the circle Q, and this point P. Let the radius of the circle be a lowercase r, and the radius of the semicircle uppercase r. So, MB equals 8 minus r, AD is the same as the radius of the circle, and DM, the radius of the semicircle minus radius of the circle. In triangle ABC, we will use Pythagoras' theorem to find BC. From Pythagoras' theorem, BC square equals AB square plus AC square. AB equals 8 centimeters. AC equals 6 centimeters. Substituting these values in the formula will give us BC square equals 8 square plus 6 square. 8 square is 64, and 6 square is 36. So, BC square equals 64 plus 36. 64 plus 36 is 100. Hence, BC square is 100. Next we find BC by taking the square root of both sides. Doing so will give us BC equals square root of 100 which is 10 centimeters. From the figure, AC equals CN which is 6 centimeters. Reason. Tangents drawn from point A to the semicircle and tangents drawn from external point are equal. Hence, BN equals 10 minus 6, which is 4 centimeters. In triangle MBN, we will apply Pythagoras' theorem to find the radius of the semicircle which is the uppercase R. It follows that, BM square equals BN square plus MN square. BM is 8 minus R, BN is 4, and MN is R. Substituting these values in the above equation, will give us, 8 minus r, square equals 4 square plus r square. Expanding, 8 minus r, square will give us 64 minus 16 r, plus r square, and the square of 4 is 16. So, 64 minus 16 r, plus r square, equals 16 plus r square. Next we collect like terms. Doing so will give us, 64 minus 16, equals r square minus r square plus 16 r, r square minus r square is 0, and 64 minus 16 is 48. And we are left with, 48 is equal to 16 r. Next, we find r by dividing through by 16. 16 will cancel out 16, and 48 divided by 16 is 3. Hence, r equals 3 centimeters. Before we proceed, please subscribe to my channel to encourage me to make more videos. Thanks. Also, in triangle DMQ, we will use Pythagoras' theorem to find DQ. From Pythagoras' theorem, MQ square equals DM square plus DQ square. Making DQ square the subject of the formula will give us DQ square equals MQ square minus DM square. From the figure, MQ is the radius of the semicircle plus the radius of the circle. Reason. External touching. DM is radius of the semicircle minus radius of the circle. Substituting these values in the formula will give us, DQ square equals, R plus R square, minus, R minus R square. Expanding, R plus R square will give us, R square plus, 2RR, 
plus r square and expanding r minus r square will give us r square minus 2rr plus r square substituting these values in the formula will give us dq square equals r square plus 2rr plus r square minus r square minus 2rr plus r square next we open the bracket by multiplying all the terms in it with the negative sign doing so will give us dq square equals r square plus 2rr plus r square minus r square plus 2rr minus r square uppercase r square minus uppercase r square will cancel out lowercase r square minus lowercase r square will also cancel out and 2r r plus 2r r is 4r r, r. So, dq square equals 4rr. Next we take the square root of both sides. Doing so will give us dq equals square root of 4rr, which equals 2 root rr. Let's consider triangle AMC and triangle QPC. Line PQ and line AM are parallel. Hence, triangle AMC and triangle QPC are similar triangles. From similar triangles, PQ over AM equals PC over AC. From the figure, PQ equals lowercase r, that is the radius of the circle, AM equals uppercase r, that is the radius of the semicircle. AC equals 6 centimeters. Let's note that. DQ equals AP which equals 2, root RR. But PC, equals AC minus AP. Since AC is 6 centimeters, and AP is 2 root RR. Then, PC equals 6 minus 2 root RR. Substituting these values in the above formula, will give us. R over R equals 6 minus 2 root R R over 6. Let's recall that, the uppercase R, which is the radius of the semicircle is 3. So, substituting it with 3, will give us, R over 3 equals, 6 minus 2 root R R over 6. Next we cross multiply. Doing so will give us 6r equals 3 times, 6 minus 2 root rr. Next we get rid of the bracket, by multiplying the terms in it with the 3 outside it. It follows that 6r equals 18 minus 6 root rr. Since 6 is common to all the terms, we divide through by 6. 6 will cancel out 6, 18 divided by 6 is 3 and 6 will cancel 6. So we are left with r equals 3 minus root r r. Let's also replace the radius of the semicircle with 3. So that, r equals 3 minus root 3 r. Which can also be written as root 3 r equals 3 minus r. Next we take the square of both sides. Square will cancel out the square root. And we are left with 3 r equals, 3 minus r, square. Expanding, 3 minus r, square. Will give us. 9 minus 6 r plus r square. So, 3 r equals 9 minus 6 r plus r square. Next we take 3 r to the right side, so that, r square minus 6 r, minus 3 r plus 9 is equal to 0. Minus 6r, minus 3r is minus 9r. So we have our square minus 9r plus 9 is equal to 0. And this is a quadratic equation. Going further, we will solve the quadratic equation using the formula method. Given a quadratic equation, ax square plus bx plus c equals 0, x equals minus b, plus or minus, square root of b square, minus 4ac, all over 2a, Comparing the two equations, a equals 1, b equals minus 9, and c equals 9. 
Hence, r equals minus minus 9, plus or minus, square root of minus 9 square, minus 4 times 1 times 9, all over 2 times 1, which will give us 9 plus or minus root 45 all over 2. Square root of 45 is approximately 6.71. It follows that r equals 9 plus or minus 6.71, all over 2. For plus, r equals 9 plus 6.71, all over 2, which is 7.85. For minus, r equals 9 minus 6.71, all over 2, which is 1.15. The radius of the circle must be less than the radius of the semicircle, hence the radius of the circle is 1.15 centimeters. To find the area of the circle, area of a circle is given by pi r square, where pi is approximately 3.14. It follows that the area of the circle is 3.14 times 1.15 square, which is equal to 4.15 centimeters square. Please subscribe to my channel to encourage me to make more videos. Thanks.